I think the concept of the stock market being rigged is crazy. Is the stock market rigged, Larry? No, I don't believe it is. Your reaction to last night's Lewis piece is what? I mean, it's pretty much expected. I don't think there were any surprises there. Um, you know, the faster trader wins. And, you know, when you see someone like Virtu who had, what, one losing day in how many years? That suggests that Michael Lewis is right, that something's rigged and something's not right. Yeah, one, one. You know, Michael and Brad, shame on both of you for falsely oh. accusing literally thousands of people and possibly scaring millions of investors in an effort to promote a business model. Do you think the markets are rigged? I think it's really hard to put a he word on it. He said it in the book. Okay, you said it in the book. That's when I knew the markets were rigged. Uh, and I, it's disgusting that you're trying to parse your words now. Do you, okay? Do you, you think can't the say that. You are, quoted, you are quoted that way in the book, but... Let, okay, let, let's walk, let's walk through so an example. Do you, do you say it? Do you believe it or not? Because you said it. Let me walk you through an example. It's a yes of, or no question. Do you believe it or not? I believe the markets are rigged. Okay, so there and, you go. And I, and I also think that you're a part of the rigging. So if you want to do this, let's do this. I, I, I so, really do. So let's, what market data do you use to price trades on direct edge? We use the direct feeds and the SIP in combination. No, no, no. I asked you a question. Not what you use to route. What do you use to price trades in your matching engine on direct edge? We the use SIP. The, we use the direct feeds. No. You yes, we SIP. do. We and now, let me talk. Look, you had a 300-page commercial, okay? So <laughs> well, let, let me talk. Can I, can let I me talk for a few minutes, <laughs> okay. okay? You shouldn't. So we have the buy side behind this. We have brokers like not just Goldman, but Morgan Stanley or JP Morgan or Bernstein or RBC. You have people in this room. You have computerized traders like Virtu that aren't coming here to scout people. And you have yeah, the general public for? behind a solution. So I visited Bats. I interviewed people. No, you people do who not. That, yes, that is false. That's that not is false. absolutely I, I, false. I, that's not false. I, I toured it. I had a tour you of did the place. That, that is untrue. It's, what do you mean it's untrue? I was there. Give me a date. Was, what date? February 5th. February Last, 5th, what year? 2013. Okay, we're going to follow up with CNBC sure. about where Michael Lewis was on February 5th, huh. 2013. Yeah. Yeah. Computerized trading has delivered benefits to the market. You're there's, for, there's you're no for competition, and you believe Absolutely. your model is superior, and you will win out. Yes, and, and again, we're not... We're not. Just don't say everybody else is corrupt but you. We're not We're, we're not saying that either, right? You said it's rigged. And, and, Do you know what that means? Well, let me... Welcome back. We are just seconds away uh, from the employment report. Up 192,000. March non-farm payrolls increased by 192,000 jobs. The unemployment rate is 6.7%. All right, welcome back. We do have a winner in our Nailed the Number contest. Actually nailed the number right on the head with a guess of 192,000 jobs for March. You've tried to win a couple times before, uh, but this one worked. What led you to 192? Um, well, to be honest, it was a little lucky. We uh, just opened at exactly 40, I believe. Again, a very happy day for the Grubhub crowd.